Talking Pirates Women's Soccer alongside head coach Linda Hamilton. I'm Kit McConico. Coach, your Pirates, fantastic starting conference. You won the first four. You dropped the last two difficult games. Sure. You fell in a tough one to TLU, 2-1, to one, and then last night to Trinity. Your thoughts on these last two matches? Yeah, I think, you know, the conference has, has gotten better over the years we've all been in here. And, and TLU is always a difficult team. They're competitive. They're physical. Um, I think for us, it was a, a tough loss at home. We, we maybe didn't play our best in the first half, kind of got behind a little bit. The good news was we came back strong in the second half, but what we know about our sport is it's a 90-minute game, and, and so the lesson we took away on Friday was you're not going to win in conference if you can only show up and play your best for half of a game. So I think that's a good lesson. First time we've seen, obviously, TLU this year, and, and they're always a, a tough, competitive customer. So um, hopefully we'll be able to exact a little revenge this coming weekend on Sunday at their place. And then, listen, Trinity is a tough team. They're always ranked uh, in the region. They're always ranked in the nation. And, and for us, Right now, we've got to realize how to close that gap. And I think we competed against Trinity. I think it was a good match. Um, what we learned is, is, again, though, a sustained 45 minutes is, is not going to be enough against a well-organized, really disciplined team like Trinity. Um, you know, to come in and, and take it to us. So we had some opportunities. I think it was a good experience for us on the first go around, but, um, you know, we, we definitely have some ground to make up. Well, the good news is back to conference play this weekend. You have games at Centenary and TLU as well, so you can get right back to the play. Obviously, you're pleased with what you've seen thus far from your team, a lot of young players contributing. Emotionally, how do you, how do you rebound after two tough losses like this? Well, I think with our sport, it's one of those up and down kinds of uh, sports. We know over the course of a season, we're going to have some positives and maybe some 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 struggles to, to valleys to climb back up. I think for us, we talk about on winning and losing. You have to have a short memory. You have to have the ability to recognize the areas to improve, make those improvements, but also let the disappointment go and move on. I mean, Trinity was last night, but you know, right, quite frankly, they're in our rear view mirror because now we've got to set our sights on, on centenary. So you can't dwell on the losses. And to be fair, you can't revel in your victories too long either. It's really a, a sport that you've got to have short memories, both with, for positives and negatives. And I think for this young, enthusiastic team, what they realized is maybe they're in the arena, but they've got to work a little more and, and close some of those nuances be a little more disciplined over the course of 90 minutes and, and hopefully take that lesson into the next game against Centenary and um, move forward from that. Pirates continue conference play this weekend on the road at Centenary and TLU. Alongside my favorite World Cup winner, Linda Hamilton, <laughs> I'm Kit McConaughey. Coach, as always, thanks for your time. Thanks, Kit.